All right, I could have gone live <clears throat> and done this, but I'm not going to do that. It'd be too easy. So what I'm going to do is we'll, so we're going to address Bombshell's uh, community post from four hours ago. Funny how the ones who call me a bum don't do shit but steal from the government, don't work, have fake injuries, mental health, use a deceased child to get money, blah, blah, blah. Huh. Let's see, who could they, who could she be speaking of? Who was stealing from the government? I don't get a check. Nobody I know gets a check. Fake injuries. Who's that? Who has a fake injury? Mental health. That would be me. And use a deceased child to get money. That would also be me. Because that's what you think. But okay, laugh my ass off. How are you going to scam people for $3,000 to fix a house not damaged and throw a party? Let's address that, Bombshell, because you all of us, you got it real wrong. Shoot the shit, raise $3,000 for Tammy Spirit Finder, a.k.a. Jack Boot Fish Eyed Fool. They gave her $3,000 to move, and she didn't. She didn't. She says she gave her landlord money to fix his own trailer. That doesn't make any sense either. And when you, so, but if you're referring to them giving Savage about 1500 when the hurricane came through, she didn't throw a party. She had all of her family at her house because their town was hit pretty good. Laugh my ass off. Oh, 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 oh. Break your arm. Say you have no insurance and hit your cash app. The fuck is that mean? Pay for your kid's wedding, but you can't pay your mortgage. Mm, again, you got that wrong. Um, <laughs> you got that wrong again, baby. Need money to get drunk at the beach. No, we had plenty of money to get drunk at the beach. Literally, literally be besties with two sexual deviants, real lifers, well, wait a second. You're collecting titty pics and pussy pics. But we have two sexual deviants. Real lifers. Funny. I can't. Let me see. Who is the only person on this platform who's ever been taken to jail for something they did on YouTube? Oh, wait a minute. That's you. Oh, that was you. Do you remember that? Okay. Expect me not to come for you. Who gives a fuck if you come for her? Nobody gives a fuck. You ain't shit, bitch. You ain't shit. You've been kicked out of every goddamn community you've been in for the same shit. Lying and going real life. Ain't nobody scared of you. Nobody. Put a wish list out for two for a grandkid with two parents. Well, who gives a fuck? You ain't buying none of the presents, so why are you mad? Let me tell you something. And you want to keep talking about Pirate's Daddy. I'm going to let her explain that to you. Not that it'll get through your skull. Here's the thing, Karen. We have husbands who love us, support us, and our children. Pirate works, obviously. My husband works, supports me, loves me, loves his children. You're never going to have that. Have you ever had anybody to do that for you? Did anybody hold you down? No. You're 50 some years old. Your glory days are well behind you. They are well behind you. Okay. You've never had to live on your own and you're showing now that you can't live on your own. You need, you went without water for what, five months, you said? Five months? And then as soon as Jill paid for your water bill, because she's a drunk idiot, then you didn't have no heat? Honey, listen, you ain't got no room to be talking about no damn body. All right? No damn body. You are the fucking idiot. You're the one living like a goddamn 20-year-old with no job. What did happen to your job? Didn't you have a job Monday, but you ain't been to work since? But that ain't my problem, because I don't pay your bills. So, I would suggest that you get your facts straight, especially on that $3,000. That's Tim's Spare Finder. Okay? Okay. 
I would suggest that you try to figure out what you're going to do when you're an old fucking lady, which is in about 10 minutes. When you don't have goddamn nothing to live off of. Nothing. You want to talk about people's daddy? Because you want us to talk about your daddy. Nobody give a fuck about your daddy. I don't give a fuck if your daddy's living it still in a goddamn fucking tub you left him in. I don't care. Nobody gives a fuck about your goddamn daddy. So don't worry about nobody else's daddy. How about that? Now, when you wake up and hear this, because I know you ain't at work, you can take it. Honey, listen, you want all this to be true. You want this to be true because you want us to be as pathetic as you. You ain't never going to have a mortgage. You ain't never going to have a husband. You ain't never going to have no kids. You ain't never going to have nothing. You whined and cried because your only mean of income was just my little Facebook where I could sell my furniture. Fuck off, dumbass. You fucked that up by lying about your goddamn stuff. Girl, you are straight up fucking mess. Like I said, you better figure out your retirement plan because you ain't got one. You could be living on $100 a month because you ain't never put nothing in fucking Social Security. And I feel for you. I really do, sweetheart. But like I said, nobody gives a fuck. Do what you got to do.